Messi, the unique talent hailing from the small town of Rosario, Argentina, carries a remarkable journey fraught with challenges. Born with the extraordinary gift of football prowess, Lionel Andres Messi's story is intertwined with the hurdles he faces within himself. In Rosario, where a flight from London spans 18 hours, the year 1987 marks the emergence of a prodigy in the humble household of an ironworker father and a part-time working mother. Despite his talent, Messi confronts myriad physical and psychological barriers. Struggling with a stature deemed short by societal norms, he grapples with self-consciousness and a lack of confidence, enduring taunts from peers during football matches. In a pivotal moment near his home, a friend's threat underscores the challenges Messi faces. Yet, his nephew, Maxi Bianchuki, intervenes, offering a glimmer of support amidst adversity. Encouraged by Messi's exceptional footballing abilities, his parents embark on a journey to nurture his talent, confronting their son's limitations head-on. During his school years, concerns arise as Messi exhibits difficulty interacting with classmates, prompting his teacher to recommend psychological assessment. However, financial constraints impede immediate access to such resources. Nevertheless, through perseverance and resourcefulness, Messi's parents eventually secure the assistance he needs, underscoring their unwavering commitment to their son's well-being and footballing aspirations. At the tender age of 11, Messi faced another challenge, a diagnosis of growth hormone deficiency, GHD, necessitating rigorous at-home treatment, including self-administering injections. But Messi's journey of overcoming limitations doesn't conclude there. Embedded within Lionel Messi's childhood narrative lies another aspect, autism. Autism Spectrum Disorder, ASD, a neurodevelopmentally condition, casts its shadow on Messi's social interactions, communication skills, and behavior. As recounted by his teacher, La Pulga exhibits shyness and struggles to engage with peers, relying on friends to voice his queries. From the age of nine, Messi was recognized as autistic within his school community. Dubbed El Pequeño Audio or the Little Mute by classmates, his journey from the schoolyard to the soccer field was marked by this aspect of his identity. Yet, his ascent to football stardom didn't diminish his autistic traits, if anything, they became more conspicuous. Even the legendary Maradona, coaching the Argentine national team, found conversing with Messi daunting, likening it to speaking with a deity. Uniquely, Messi's communication preferences further underscore his autism. Preferring text messages over calls, his aversion to direct verbal interaction extends even to telephonic conversations, prompting curiosity. Observations of Messi's daily routines offer further insight. His prolonged and irregular sleep patterns align with traits commonly associated with autism. Testimonials from his former doctor and half-sister attest to Messi's penchant for extended slumber and reluctance to stray far from the comforts of home, immersing himself in solitary pursuits like PlayStation gaming. Beyond lifestyle indicators, Messi's playing style has sparked speculation about autistic traits. Tito Villanova, in reflection, noted Messi's immersion in his own world on the field, playing with a childlike focus, seemingly oblivious to his surroundings, relishing every touch of the ball. Despite these observations, Messi himself has not acknowledged autism, leaving the discussion to others, including Brazilian legend Romario. Romario suggested that Messi exhibits traits akin to Asperger's syndrome, a condition falling within the autism spectrum, characterized by social difficulties and introspection. Remarkably, this syndrome can amplify focus, evident in Messi's exceptional concentration during matches, aligning with his distinctive playing style. Moreover, global autism associations, such as the World Autism Network Association, ACN, have embraced Messi as a figure within their community, further fueling the discourse. Yet, Messi's silence persists, reminiscent of former Manchester United defender John Akane's journey. Dubbed the Spaceman, for his detached demeanor, Akane navigated his career without acknowledging his autism until his mid-forties. Upon retirement, Akane bravely confronted his condition, finding solace and inspiration in sharing his story, echoing a potential path for Messi. However, whether Messi will follow suit or continue his reticence remains an open question, shrouded in speculation.